A new study may have wrapped up a decades-old mystery. What really killed the dinosaurs? There have been several theories, competition from mammals, global volcanoes, aliens, but the theory that's gained the most ground is that an asteroid did the deed. The most likely candidate is the asteroid that caused the Chicxulub crater on Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula. The crater is 110 miles across and the impact that caused it is estimated to be around a billion times more powerful than the bombs dropped on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The explosion covered the Earth with a layer of iridium and ash commonly called the KT boundary. It's believed all the ash blocked sunlight and wreaked havoc on the ecosystem, causing the massive die-off which claimed most of the dinosaurs. The asteroid impact theory already has the support of most scientific organizations, but there was one little detail left unexplained. The best estimates for when the asteroid struck put it 180,000 years after the time the dinos died out. That's a problem. The new study in the journal Science claims to have settled the issue. Using ultra-precise dating techniques, researchers now say they've narrowed the Chicxulub crater's event's time frame down to within 32,000 years of the extinction event, which, geologically speaking, is within a gnat's eyebrow, according to the team's leader. It may look like the evidence that a meteor doomed the dinosaurs is now ironclad, but Space.com reports it took a long time to gain acceptance, going from a laughable idea in the 1980s to the dominant explanation over the course of several decades. And even now, there's some disagreement. A writer for Slate recounts a 2010 row between scientists supporting the asteroid theory and those who had other ideas, concluding, The truth is that we are only just beginning to understand what happened 66 million years ago. Recognizing that an asteroid impact played a part in the massive die-off was an unexpected, magnificent discovery, but all the same, the mystery remains. One of those mysteries is the meteor strike itself. Another study out this month questions whether the Chicxulub crater was caused by one six-mile-wide asteroid or a much rarer double asteroid strike. Let the new debate begin. For Newsday, I'm Elizabeth Hagenhorn.